Greetings, drillers, pickers, and rockhounds. Bassy here with another look at multi-boxing the mole. Today, we will look at more multi-character visuals in the mole. We will see three positions simultaneously, pilot, left minor, and right minor. This will provide more of a rounded look at multi-boxing the mole. At the end of the video, you will see firsthand why you need to stay sharp, even when just coming back to cash in. So first thing we do, we get lined up to Daymar and get ready to quantum out there. Right after that, we'll begin the process of setting up. So here we go. Setup involves getting the miners in position. This means we have to switch computers, in this case to the left, and walk the miner out, get through the doors, get faced out, but not sit in the seat just yet. Then we'll switch over to the other side once the first miner is in place. And here we are working on the right side, going through the doors, and just getting into position. Once we are where we want to be, then we begin the process of rigging out the miners. And that's pretty simple. We just have the miners sit down in their chairs and the rest of it's automated. So we'll go ahead and get each miner positioned. Then we'll go ahead and activate them one at a time. Now that they're rigged out, we'll go ahead and set each miner to look outward, left to the left and right to the right. Again, this is to take advantage of view and scan. Now that we're all set, we'll go ahead and transition down to the surface of the moon and look for a good spot to do some mining. Now that we're all set up, we're headed down. We'll go ahead and frack a couple of rocks, collect some ore, close up, and head on back. Easy peasy, right?
Okay, we're all done. We're headed up, get out of the atmosphere, set up to head on home. Just before we do, we'll close up. You'll see the visual of that, and then we'll be quantuming back to Fort Ollis. Our speed is 638 as we align. Keep that in mind. It'll be important when we come out of quantum. Just like portals and stargates, speedy thing in equals speedy thing out of quantum. My speed has caused me to overshoot Olisar and become a target for a pad camper who's got me locked up and is about to start shooting. So I need to focus, go ahead and ramp my speed up but not too much so I can burn straight at Olisar get in the armistice zone and get out of danger. When I get to the armistice zone, the first thing I'm gonna do is pivot around, reverse direction and apply max thrust so that I can stop within the armistice zone. That, my friends, is how you get past the pad camper. So that's a reality and part of the game that I really love. Now that we're back, down and safe, time to go collect some cash for the rocks. Let's see how we did today. Thanks for joining me today. If you got something out of this, share with your friends or org mates. If this was good enough to share, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to get word on the next one. Please share any comments you may have below. I would really like to hear from you. Remember to mine where no one else mines so you can mine like no one else. Until next time, this is Vassy. Fly safe, and I'll see you out in the verse.